It's senior night at Barnett Stadium as 5-3 and three Sterling hosts 7-0 and oh Manville. Manville leads 7-6 in the first when Tucker Yarborough fires for Malachi McLean and McLean absorbs the hit and holds off for a 19-yard touchdown pass play. Mavs lead 14-6. Sterling would answer as Anthony Brown swings it out to Frank Brown. He makes a man miss and then tiptoes down the sideline. He stays in bounds and takes up 47 yards for the score. Sterling trailing 14-13 after one. In the second, Yarborough goes back to the air. Looking downfield for Jalen Paxton. It's a 32-yard scoring strike. Manville leaves 21-13. On the next drive, Sterling faces fourth and 30 from its own 10. And what a time to call a fake punt. Frank Brown takes off, and he has a lane. He splits two defenders, and he's gone. 90 yards to the house. All the way for the Raiders' touchdown. Wow, what a play. But Manville blocks the PAT and returns it for two. So it's 23-19 Mavericks at intermission. Later in the third, Sterling leads 26-23, but Yarborough airs it out one more time. It connects with Jalen Walthall. It's a 34-yard touchdown pass, and Manville reclaims the lead 29-26. Same score in the fourth, when Sterling makes a costly miscue on special teams. The Raiders can't handle the punt, and the Mavs fall on the loose ball for the takeaway. Manville's offense then cashes it into points as DeMonte Seymour takes a handoff, goes right up the middle, breaks a tackle, and gets into the end zone for a 21-yard score. Mavs go up 37-26. And Seymour isn't done. He puts this one on ice as he slips free of a defender and then fights his way in for a 36-yard score. Manville holds off a tough challenge from Sterling and remains unbeaten with a 44-26 win.